Yeah, and you're not in. You're not in. Come, come on, big person. Wait, say what? Uh, James, let me let me come. Squeeze in. Dude, you have to come right. You have to okay. Come like right. That's like how knees. Okay, yeah, like yeah, this, yeah. like right this, like bed. this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Cool. Yeah. cool, 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 cool. Yeah, that's fine. I'll put that. In. Actually, do you know what? Can put I put that in a non-spinning spot just because I can. No, no, I can. no. You need to be a central point for yeah, the yeah, yeah, log. Okay. Slug. Okay. Cool. I can move more. Cause yeah. There, there. I'm still on the screen. But yeah. Okay. There we go. Come closer. Perfect. I've never had four people on my on my thing before. Uh, you might have to come a little I think, bit more yeah. because there's still a space for this. Enio, so yeah. Grab as much as you can. Okay, yeah. perfect. And Enio, if you lean in a little bit, okay, like this. Hey everyone, it's the first time I'm doing this kind of video. Now, I was down to the magic circle and I met these guys and said, you know what, let's go upstairs and chat about something. So, we decided to talk about practice because I think all of us here we practice a lot and I think it's much better for me sitting here and talking to you about practice might as well get in on a conversation with some of the guys who practice the most so let's do a little introduction with everyone let's start with Florian first evening I'm a juggler uh, and I got into card magic recently four years ago just for me recently. recently yeah. yeah. <laughs> so forward. Yeah. So Florian was in the interview earlier. If you didn't see that interview, definitely go and watch that. Put the link to that below. Uh, great interview. Yeah. Uh, obviously, you know me. I do a lot of coins, pens, rings, and then James. Uh, introduce yourself. Hi, my name is James. I'm a close-up magician uh, for the most part. A typical kind of performer, performing at corporates and weddings and uh, parties and things. But I also have a particular interest in sleight of hand card magic. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Great. Uh, hi there, hi Manu, and I'm an apprentice here to the Magic Circle, and that's it. I just practice all day long. <laughs> Perfect. Excellent. So who better on this path, eh? So let's start with the first thing is, where do you practice? Now, do you practice at home? But I mean, I personally, I don't, I don't practice at all. At home, I do nothing. The really? Only, yeah, the only practice is when I'm out. So obviously, practicing my routine is at gigs while I'm performing. But the actual practice is done usually on trains. When I'm ah. sitting on the public transport yeah. on on yeah, yeah. tubes, that's why I don't drive anywhere. Some of you like, oh, get a car. I don't want to drive. I just usually use public transport, trains. I have my little a jacket on my lap, and then I start rolling my rings, my coins, and all that sort of stuff. Mm. What about you? Oh, for me, it's a very constant uh, concept. For me, I'm almost always doing something with my hands, uh, and either that's juggling for new new effects. Like some of my acts, I, I already can do, and those I don't need to practice. But new things, I always practice, and especially with cards, I'm always doing something. Even while cooking, you know, three wow. minutes, I'm like just like put them on the microwave and then like shake it and then take the cards back. That's dedication. So, but that's just like mm, obsession because I like it. I don't know about it. Similar, you, yeah, I love it. Um, that I pretty much have a pack of cards in every room of my house that I pick. It's, it's almost kind of like a compulsion sometimes, you know. That I always, sometimes I have to force myself not to do it because I think it's a, bit, it's a bit crazy. But I do have a pack of cards in every room and yeah, like if I'm cooking, I have them in the toilet. Sorry, not that great. Uh, but That's any great. time You're like sitting that, there doing so nothing. Well, well, yeah. Exactly. I exactly. sit on the loo and I look at my Instagram comments and that sort of thing. <laughs> anyway, what about you? Uh, I do. I do. I have like a, a schedule of practice. I do have a routine of practice from the morning uh, with a coffee in the morning at okay. the breakfast, and then going in the afternoon with cards and coins. Really? Wow! Yeah, that's really interesting. That's so good. you organize your schedule? I'm I'm perfectly organized with my schedule routine. Wow. You have yeah, a set of kind of the slides of the routine. That's what you're uh, going to work on that day. Yes, yes, yes. Wow! Yes. Which are always. Um, what I'm always the same. I feel like I, I like should to be practice. doing that. Yeah, yeah actually, <laughs> because that's, this feels that's like a, aims. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's really good. I started doing that a bit more because yeah. my interest now has gone into more kind of gambling routines where you have to be right. sat at the table, so you need yeah. a certain kind of space. Yeah. And that's forced me to be a little bit more disciplined because a lot of the stuff I used to do is generally walk around so you can do it with the pack of your hand at any, any time. But now, because I have to have a table, I do now have a little bit more discipline where I have an hour or two a day where I sit at the table and I'm just going to practice whatever I'm going to practice. Yeah. Awesome. I've become a bit, bit more disciplined. Okay. Excellent. That's very interesting, yeah. And also, just to let you know that there's a lot of people coming into the magic circle in this divan room right now because the lecture's finished. So we're going to end this one quickly, but before we go, we want to just say where can we find you? So, Florian, where can people see you? 
Oh, you can see me anywhere in central London, restaurant, hotel, bars. Uh, yeah, you'll be posting yeah. on your Instagram channel. Yeah, which I'll exactly. Link to. I'll yeah. link all of your Instagrams down in the video below. James, yeah. what about you? Do you have any shows that you want people to come no to? No public see shows coming up if anybody's interested. Uh, my website's londonwizard.co.uk. I perform at some public events and I'll post on there, but, but nothing regular. Perfect. And you, what about you? So I'm just an apprentice. I don't do this uh, professionally, but so, uh, at the you moment. You work in a shop or something? I work in the, in, the med, uh, in the magic shop. In Covent Garden. Perfect. There we go. So if you want to go to the magic shop in Covent Garden, yeah. you can check him out. I'll leave all their links in the description. I hope you enjoyed this video. We're going to have to cut this video short because of a lot of people. Maybe if you want to know more about practice, message me in the comments and I will get this panel back again and chat about something else. All right. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.